An otter! Look at it! Oh ho, 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 boy! Look at the catfish, look at them all go. What is going on, Kaferos? Welcome back to another video here today. This pond right here is actually an otter pond, and we're gonna get more into it uh, right now. But first, let me introduce you to Robert Arrington, deer meat for dinner. Now, first thing I wanna ask you, how did you get this otter in the first place? Buddy of mine, Tim Dutilio, called me about four months ago and was like, look, man, got a little otter here. Its mother was eaten by an alligator. It's orphaned, it's just laying on the bank. And uh, Sarah, my wife, was like, let's go get it. So we ran out there got it and brought it home. She had to start off with a little eyedropper, just a tiny little eyedropper trying to get any fluids into it. It had like mucus and pus covering its eyes. It was very skinny. Basically it would have died that night, no questions asked. Uh, the next day she went to the store, she started finding different bottles and finally found a bottle that she could get it some, some milk in and started feeding it baby puppy milk. Well, day after day after day it started, you know, putting on some weight and it's just became part of the house and lives out here in this pond. We keep it, but we don't necessarily keep it. It's just here. <laughs> and so now we stock the pond. We've got loads of little invasive cichlids and different types of things like that. I mean, we literally just pulled up and this otter was just chilling. Just right here. I mean, her it's... name is Kia and she's just like a part of our homestead. Coolest part is it stays. It totally could roam away and go anywhere it wants. You got a brand new house being built too in the background by the way. Cool, huh? It's pretty dope. But hey, are we gonna go catch fish? Let, let, let's go fish? catch some fish to feed this thing. So yeah, it's a rescued otter that they just brought here, put in their pond, and they feed it. And you know an otter eats two to three times its body weight every single day. Crazy. Every single day. That's mind blowing. So this otter eats so much fish that we're gonna need to go get fish. No, well not me, but Yo, in this case we are idea. going to. What's the Pop idea? Pop a big thumbs up if you think we should do a tournament like who catches the most fish for Kia let's do it all right hey let's if you it. guys want to see I'm gonna be posting up a video on this as well I'll cause... have uh, Deer Mates channel linked in the description we're actually gonna have a challenge here let's do it oh let's do it's it. a challenge no, I've never let, been a part of a let, challenge let's before. do a challenge there's no even you don't even I mean you can hit the like button if okay, you want but you, you don't do have get, to hey you do get the uh, award for the best dress challenge I mean what yes. it literally the boy is looking clean look right at now. Her, look at her she's just <laughs> cruising right here look how sick that is I mean this thing has the complete ability to walk away if it wanted to, it, and it just doesn't. It just hangs out. This is its home. This is its pond. Look, is that home, insane? Up here and hangs out. Oh, she's going. She's going looking in there. She's in her little cave. Check that out. Hey, you got fish in your mouth. So how crazy is that? As as we speak, she's actually chowing down on a fish right now. But the bottom line is. This is an otter pond, he rescued an otter, and it needs to eat. It eats a lot, as we already spoke about beforehand. We're gonna go catch cichlids, all these invasive species that aren't supposed to be here in Florida. Net them up with a cast scent, dip net some minnows, and we're gonna load this pond with fish that'll probably only last, what Robert, maybe a day? We're probably gonna try to catch like 50 fish to put in here, and she'll eat them all this week. Look at that, that's how fast it goes. So, whole different thing. I've never even fed an otter, never touched an otter. I'm about to, let's touch it right now. Okay, maybe not. Touched you. Haha, <laughs> gotcha. So me and David are over here. We're like half dead. We just got here to the hey, farm. Hey, and hey, <laughs> there's something on your lens, bro. Hey, what's up, everybody? <laughs> We just tried a jalapeno pepper. He tried like way too much, and I just want to roll the footage right now. It's funny, it's hilarious. Before we get to fishing, let's just roll it real quick. Look at the bait turning red. Oh my god. <laughs> I spit it out immediately, dude. Oh, I don't know. He's about to puke, dude. Bro. That's hotter than a ghost pepper. Well, I grow is the hottest jalapeno <laughs> they, they make. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, this is no joke. We wanted you to just touch it to your lips, not actually. He ate half of it. Bite the he thing in half. Follow we me need on Instagram. You. We're riding to the canal right now. We're gonna get some fish. You see that? Mm-hmm. That's not the secret weapon. This right here is. This is Carly Haluska. If y'all watch, if y'all watch deer meat for dinner, she is absolutely one of the best parts of the whole channel. I love this girl. 
So that's the secret. She's the one that's gonna catch the fish for us. Yes. She All right, is. sounds good. So you think you're gonna beat me with that little yellow thing? Well, I believe the Oreo, what I like to call it, the white and black is more powerful. I've got my bucket, my rod, same lure, but mine's white. Oh gosh. Come on, right here. All right. <laughs> All right. I'm just on my intro and he's ready fishing. So, hey, what's that? That's a cichlid. That's a cichlid, a Mayan cichlid. You know what this is called? That's point number one. It's called Kia's dinner. What that's called. That is an invasive species, too. So, hey, look at that. Robert Arrington on board with one fish. I need to get on board. Let me let me start casting. Oh boy. Guess what that is, Rob? Yeah, I get 50% of that fish because you're on my side of the canal. Number one. Got him, boys. That's another. Hey, Rob. Hey. What is that? Yeah, that's called your poacher is what that's called. <laughs> look, at, look, at, look, he's going to go in my spot. Number two. Look at the colors on that fish. Yes, sir. All right, so a quick update. I'm winning three to one. Robert's over there. Yee! Hey, Robert! I, no, I <laughs> I've got a good advantage on you right now. It is four to one. I found the hot spot, all right? So listen. Oh, it's peeing everywhere. All right. This is number four for otter. Our otter Kia. They're otter Kia. I don't own an otter, but I wish it was mine. That's number five. Quick update here. I don't know how much footage I've got, but we are currently, he just caught another fish, so it's five to two, and then he whipped out the cast net, and that just, cheating. I'm just kidding. We are just here to load up on some bait, and uh, the challenge was just for fun. I'll take the dub on this one, because clearly, he's still trying to catch me, but it's not, it's not working, so. Without further ado, they're flying the drone, and, uh, we're gonna head back to the house and feed the otter Kia. Look at the catfish, look at them all go. There's your uh, pet Funko. Oh yeah. Check this out too. Isn't that cool? Touch it. Yeah. Isn't that awesome? Oh, there's a big catfish. Dude, this thing is gonna go crazy. Look at all the fish. Now these fish have no idea because they're just put into this pond. They're still trying to find all the holes. This otter's gonna come in and it's gonna go ham. Part of having an otter is you gotta go out consistently, get a bunch of live baits and feed it. So that's what we did today. Still got more in here. We should probably do another friendly reminder. By the way, these fish that we're feeding this otter, is not native to Florida. It's not supposed to be here. That's right. So these cichlids are non-native species that need to be removed from the wild because they're literally overpopulating and eating native fish. So that's, right. that's why these guys are perfect to feed our otter. Correct. Watch or this. your otter. <laughs> Woo! I was just counting Look to make sure they are. make sure you weren't I squeezing wasn't lying. One in on me. I'm telling you, I beat you. Now he, he got the whole bucket full, but Good there we go. Deal. Ready to put the otter in? Let's do it. Oh my Let's gosh. <laughs> Let's see how you do fish. Let's see him. Ready for this? It's only oh, a matter of time. Wow. It's so sick. Oh, watch this. Here we go. All right, how long is it going to take? How long is it going to take? I don't think it's. Oh, look at him chasing. Look at him chasing. Brother there. <laughs> she always grabs him by the tail or the back. Side. There it is. Oh. Oh, ho, ho, success! <laughs> what she's gonna do? She'll start at the tail and literally eat her way all the way to the head. She's gonna take that, that fish and eat it from the tail all the way to the head. That's some crazy stuff. By the way, it's the first person I've ever seen have a pet otter. That's dope. It's all about taking care of the wildlife. That, that otter would have died without a doubt 
Yeah. If we would have left it in the woods one more night, brought it back, Sarah put her blood, sweat, and tears into that animal, mm -hmm. and now she's alive. If she wanted to leave, it's she could literally to, go right yeah, through that right fence, through fence and be gone. And it, and it also like follows everyone around, lets you pet it. It's so cool. That right there is feeding a pet otter. I ain't never seen anything like that before in my life. Look how much you're feeding and look how tiny it is. Just wait till it gets five feet long. <laughs> That's all I got for you today. Uh, I'm out here with Rodrigo from Predatory Fins. We're actually heading up north to do something that I might make a video on. I'm not sure. You probably see it around. Definitely on one of our Instagrams at Predatory Fins at Bulk Pharaoh. But thank you all for watching. We fed an otter, a pet otter. First time I've ever seen a pet otter in my life. It was super, super cool. I'm just gonna pop up like a bunch of positive comment shout outs. Like, Look at all these. This is the most I've ever done for sure. That, that is for sure. So thank you to everyone for commenting positive comments down below. If you want to have your positive comment on the screen, all you got to do is like the video and comment something positive down